Black people and religion, listen to this. Black people to black people. You all are okay with us doing whatever we want to do, specifically church folk. You're okay with us doing whatever we want to do, except when it comes to believing what we want to believe. If a black person says, I'm going to move to River Oaks, that's a nice area in Houston, right? Okay, girl, I see you. You're moving up. If a black person wants to go to college and get a degree or get their master's or PhD, ooh, ooh, ooh. If they want to travel and go somewhere, but as soon as they say, I'm not a Christian, what you mean you're not a Christian? You're not a believer? You don't believe in God? Oh, you church hurt. Like, why are you so against the freedom of people? Like, we get on the white man for keeping us in bondage and keeping us slaves and not allowing us to be free to think and free to write, free to read, free to move about the country, right? Then we get free. We get to live where we want, get the jobs we want, travel where we want buy the cars that we want, but as soon as we want to believe something different other than Christianity, then it's a problem. Then it's like a real problem. Like there's a chokehold, like y'all start to, to debate and y'all start to get angry and y'all start to spew venom and hate and scriptures and judgment. You'll praise us whenever we want to go do anything else outside of believing something that we were raised and we're choosing to expand, we're choosing to evolve, we're choosing to have Christ consciousness, all the things, you know, some are choosing not to believe anything at all. What is it to you? Why do you have to get so angry and be so controlling? Like you're so against freedom, get so wound up and so bound when somebody's like, oh Lord, you're not a Christian. And then try to convince somebody to stay in it, to come back to it, to be in it. And that that's the right way and just, quoting Jesus, quoting the Bible as if you are God's general and his deputy. Just think about it. Why is it that black people to black people, we're free to move, stay, do, marry? Oh, you finna marry this person? Okay, good. Okay. Even if we marry outside our race, you may have a few things to say, but you don't go off like, you know, when it comes to religion, when it comes to religion, whoo, it is a chokehold. When I told people I was building a Perry home, single mom, two kids, pay for it myself, no co-signer. Nobody debated me. Now, why are you going to move over there? Why are you moving into that area? Now, why are you choosing that builder? Now, see, nobody said anything about that. When I decided to go get my master's degree, no fight, no struggle, all praise, all congratulations. <laughs> when I said I'm going to move to a different city, okay, girl, you brave. Ooh, ooh, ooh. When I say I don't go to church anymore, oh, bring out the Calvary, stone her right now stoner versus okay tell me more about that or just okay have fun be blessed love you just accept just allow what somebody chooses to do with their life and focus on your life because i know every area in your life is not perfect because if it was you definitely wouldn't be in somebody's tiktok comments you'd be off enjoying life living your best life spending all your money okay somewhere chilling and not bothering somebody about the freedom that they're living. Why are you so bothered about the choices that someone is choosing to make in their life? Why can't you just love? Why can't you just love? 